your eighth of an inch ribbon and cut four pieces that are four and a half inches long and make sure, make sure to seal the ends. So these are going to be our spider legs and we're going to make the bend in the legs with a uh, lighter. And so you're going to take your piece of ribbon and a lighter and we're going to turn it on and that heat is going to hit the ribbon and then it will bend. And so make sure that you know exactly where you want the bend to be and then it's got to be the same on all the pieces. So I'm going to make my bend about right here. It's about half an inch from the end. See how cool that is. And then do the other side. And then when you're done with that, just go ahead and do that with the other four piece, other three pieces. And then you might, um, if you can see that the ribbon goes a certain way, so it goes this way. And so I generally would make sure it's laying that way when you make the feet. All right, and now we're going to glue it onto our clip. Have your lined clip and your spider legs ready, as well as your hot glue gun. So take your clip and then place just a dab of glue in the center. And then take one of your spider legs and we're gonna make an X. And just make sure that's centered. And you can probably you can bend your ribbon if you want to to make sure you have it exactly centered. And then just add some more glue for the other leg. spider legs. Take your corker ribbon and we're going to cut it into a bunch of small pieces. These pieces are about one and a half inches long. And then you're also going to want your needle and thread. Make sure your thread is matching. And we're basically just going to make a corker bow. So we're going to take our piece, find the middle, and put the needle through. Take your next piece from the middle and do the same. Okay, and once we've got them all on there, kind of squish them together and then pull the needle through and then bring it back. Make sure not to pull too hard because we don't want the the knot to go through. And then we're just going to go back and forth a few times just to secure the bow. And that gives you the spider body. Now we're going to make the bow for our spider. And this is just the simple bow. You bring the two tails down like this and then just bring the back down like that. Perfect. Just take your needle and thread, wrap around. Tightening as you go. Okay, and then if you use like an orange ribbon or orange thread, you're probably fine just to leave it like this. But I use black, and so I do have some eighth and inch ribbon that I'm going to uh, cover that black thread. So I'm just gonna take this side and add a dab of glue 
And then take my ribbon and place it just in the back there in the middle. And then I'm going to bring it around like this. So I'm just going to cut there. Dab of glue. And then bring that over. And now I just gotta even up these tails. And seal them. Okay, and that finishes our little bow that's gonna go on the spider. All right, so have your, your clip with your legs, the corker bow, the little bow, and your two googly eyes. Then we're gonna put together our spider ribbon sculpture. So take your little body, and then put some glue onto the middle of the clip, over the legs. And then we're gonna take the body and place it on. And now we're going to add the googly eyes. So take an eye, put a dab of hot glue on it, and then put it on. And then take your so, we're going to see where we want to put it, so probably like right there. So I'm going to actually put some glue onto the corker. And onto the back of the bow. Make sure to get the glue onto the tails as well. Isn't that so cute? I just love this spider ribbon sculpture. And as you can see, it's so easy to make. Thank you so much for watching. And for all of your supplies, please check out theribbonretreat.com. We've got great prices and a great selection.